Uh, hello. Okay. <coughs> uh, I'm Ko Mizushima, junior of Kyon University. Uh, today, I'm going to talk about vegetable and fruit harvest. <coughs> this is, here is the uh, page number. Uh, this is the overview of my presentation. Uh, first, uh, ah, I will introduce harvesting machine. First, I would like to talk about the explanation of harvest in introduction. And second, I want to explain about the uh, method of harvesting. And lastly, I would like to give some of my conclusion. Hey, do you know and have been uh, seen before a crop harvester, the machine, the machine's role is gather crop and reduce farmer's hard work in field. This is one of the famous. Uh, uh, machine in Japan. It harvests rice and separates seeds from the straw. Uh, there are many kinds of harvesting harvest in the world. So I'm going to uh, I'm going to introduce some of it. In my presentation, I will show three types of harvester: uh, root, leaf, and fruit harvester. And now I would like to show you what crops could be harvested by machine and which crop are classified with each categories. Uh, first is root vegetable, potato, carrot, Japanese radish, burdock, onion, Chinese yam are in this group. And second is leaf vegetables. And there is uh, cabbage, lettuce, Spanish, Chinese uh, cabbage, green onion, and <coughs> are in this group. And lastly, fruits categories. It's citrus, olive, blueberry, grape are uh, in this group. <coughs> now I'm going to explain the eat method of roots, leaf, fruit harvest one of by with uh, one by one with video. Uh, food is uh, root vegetable. This is carrot harvester using front end pro. It digs up underground crops and feeds them onto an elevator. While the elevator carries crops upwards, small debris fall down. Crops are carried onto conveyor belt where they are separated from larger stone and admixture and graded. <coughs> but this machine has current problems. Vegetables digger uh, bigger than 50 centimeters can be harvested and need to be picked up by human. And next is leaf vegetable harvester. This is cabbage harvester. <coughs> the bike shell screw auger holds the base of cabbage between the left and right grooves. Pull them out of the ground and adjust the cutting height. At the same time, other leaves and base are cut and transferred to the end of the screw auger to be returned to the, to the field. <coughs> a pincer grip bell move with a screw auger to pull out cabbage and transport them to an elevator after discarded outer level, uh, leaves and bases. Uh, but this machine has also current problems. It harvests non-selective, and that is they harvest both mature and 
immature products, so wastage of products definitely increase. And last is fruit harvester. Uh, this is stress harvester. This machine consists uh, This machine consists in mainly two parts uh, Shaker and collector <coughs> First it shakes tree and drops on the net uh, Next it collects crops by collecting pot <coughs> But it is sure that this has current problems. Fruits are damaged and we can use it only for processed fruits. Uh, in my conclusion, many challenges still need to be overcome man many current problems. But I think this is very interesting because we have chance to make great innovation on harvester. I think the most ideal harvester has these three elements. Uh, <coughs> Auto-selective scale, which enable to harvest only mature products. Non-damage scale, which enable us to use fresh fruit products. And uh, versatility skills, we want to use machine in any condition and anywhere else we want to. Uh, lastly, in my dream, I want to make bipedal robots. Uh, it's because that is, I think bipedal could make robots skillful and multiple task machine. I believe bipedal robots change nowadays how work agriculture. Thank you for listening. Are there any questions? Probably somebody has a question. No? Okay. Thank you for your presentation. I have a question on the vegetable and fruit harvesters. Mm -hmm. uh, some vegetables uh, could, uh, may not be mature, others mm -hmm. young. Mm -hmm. And some may also uh, contain some, some maybe parasite infection. Mm -hmm. Does the harvester, uh, is the harvester able to differentiate mm -hmm. between uh, these vegetables? Mm -hmm. I think uh, the uh, technology will improve <coughs> and the um, improved it can uh, we can make it but uh, today's um, technology uh, we can't eat because uh, if we can but the cost of uh, that is very high, so uh, it is difficult. <coughs> Are there any other questions? Thank you for the presentation. And I would like to know uh, more about the buying pedal harvesting machine. Uh, can I see the buying pedal machine harvesting machine uh, somewhere? Like in Japan or America. Oh. <coughs> uh, <coughs> uh, bipedal machine, uh, it's my own idea. So no, uh, no bipedal machine in the world. Thank you for your presentation. Last question. If 
I can let let there are three mention it I can I just one. Which one do you think is the central? Sorry, I can't listen, so please say it again. Okay. Uh, which one is the and why? They have three machine. Which one do you think is the Which one do you think is working the best now? Working best now. Ah, okay. Uh, I think mm, it's very difficult question. Uh, I think root vegetable harvesting is the best <coughs> uh, now because the work of root vegetable is very hard. We have to uh, uh, we have to dig out and that Dig process is very hard, so this is very useful, I think. 